people fighting atop washing machines. A 911 caller reports at least one of the combatants has sought higher ground and is now on top of a washing machine. Well, Teddy writes in and says, This is Johnny Knoxville, and welcome to Jackass. <laughs> Ah, uh, the red police light is armed. That means, well, either A, I just hit the jackpot and ski ball and I want those kind of tickets, or B, the kind of tickets you don't want to have when you end up on the Citizen app. Nobody wants picked up, right? You guys know I love the Citizen app. This time we're coming to you from LA. So here we go. Here's another round of crazy, outrageous 911 calls in LA via the Citizen app. Our first one, two large pizzas taken at knife point. Doesn't need a pizza cutter for those instead? Oh, here's one, deodorant stolen from CVS at gunpoint. That could potentially be some deadly BO. Reporter shots fired from ice cream truck. Are you detecting a theme here? Oh, are you serious? Man whipping pedestrians with rope. Well, Josh Lazy comments, when a pedestrian comes along, you must whip it. I am not an opposed to singing for your comedy. I didn't write it, that guy did. Boys on scooters throwing fireworks inside Michaels. That will certainly liven up your afternoon of scrapbooking. Broomstick wielding man apprehended after pursuit. The officer advises the suspect has dropped the broomstick and is now complying with police. Well, I'll be a son of a witch. Nude man bathing while holding dual knives. Is that a little hard to do trying to bathe naked when you got two knives? Ouch. Woman brandishing spatula. It's now reported she has a spatula and is threatening a man. While well, Pyrosynthesis comments, I would defend myself with a turkey baster. Woman whacking person with stolen sign. The woman has reportedly returned to the location and is using the stolen sign as a weapon to assault someone. Okay, well, Ned RP comments, sign of the times. Oh, funny. Katrome comments, did the sign say Biden 2020? I love when they let you comment in these stories now, they're great. Disrobed woman hurling feces at passerby. Run, don't walk. Two men throwing water balloons at passing vehicles. Oh, there's a little summer fun there in the heat. Man threatened with candlestick. Was the dude's name Jack and he was trying to be nimble? Woman threatening person with hot beans. Police have received a report of a woman threatening to throw hot beans onto a person. Well, Grover Hogan comments, at least she's not going for the whole enchilada. Yuck, yuck, yuck. What a jerk comments, don't call the cops, grab a tortilla. Oh. Oh, here's one, man chasing vehicles with flamethrower. Well, Martin Leon comments, Elon Musk has lost his mind. Man sitting on fire hydrant performing lewd acts. Eh, it's probably a porno movie shoot. Oh, we're getting crazy now because we got a clown climbing the 6th Street Bridge. A 911 caller has reported a man is wearing a clown suit and climbing the bridge over California Route 110. Clowns are scary. And finally, rats caused AC malfunction smoke condition. Firefighters discovered a rat's nest inside of an upper floor air conditioning unit that may have caused it to malfunction. And that's it. Those are crazy, funny, and outrageous 911 calls in Los Angeles as reported via the Citizen app. You guys know I love the Citizen app, and man, this thing is really expanding. It's in tons of cities now. It has a good purpose. It tries to warn you of a 911 emergency or something bad going down in your neighborhood. But of course, it reports the funny things that people call 911 for too as well. Look, I make no money off this thing. I just have fun with it. You can download it in the iTunes store. You can download it in the Google Play store or wherever you get your apps. But have fun with it because it's a citizen app. And you know what else you want to have fun with? This web show by clicking that like or subscribe button down below. Lots of big shows here in the Jersey Joe 50 YouTube channel waiting for you legally here each and every week. Jersey Joe here getting hypnotized by this police light saying, I'll see you next time, I hope. <laughs>